Welcome to another video. In this video, we're going to be installing the lens guard on the Insta 360 One X2 camera. Um, before we begin, I'm just going to wipe the camera down with some alcohol uh, just to make sure I remove any residue that might be, you know, on the camera right now that might hinder um, the adhesive that has to hold the lens guard. So I'm just going to give it a proper wipe. I'm using 70% alcohol. You could use whichever alcohol you have, you know, or if you have another um, solution that is good for this kind of thing. So I'm just drying off the excess alcohol that was on there. The previous uh, pad was wet and this one is dry. so just to make sure there's no moisture. I'm also uh, gonna wipe the lens uh, just to make sure there are no prints on the lens or any anything that could obstruct uh, the view once you affix the lens guard. So you wanna make sure the lens is clean So this indent on the lens guard right here is a hole that you want to match up with the hole on the camera. So if you look on the camera, there's a hole that's the microphone. So you want to make sure you don't cover that with the lens guard. So we're just going to remove this blue tab and that exposes the, the adhesive. That, that is supposed to affix the lens guard. Just make sure the holes line up. Um, that is the hole on the camera and the hole on the lens guard because you don't want to cover the microphone on the camera. So once you have that lined up, uh, you could go ahead and just give it a firm press. Press around the edges just to make sure it's affixed properly to the camera. feels like a sturdy adhesive so um, it's not something that should come off easily feels pretty sturdy so you want to press it all the way around just to make sure there's no space between the lens guard itself and the camera so you want to make sure it's affixed tightly And now we're going to do the other side. So we want to give that a wipe as well, just to make sure the lens are clean. And it's the same idea. We want to make sure we line up the hole on the lens guard with the hole on the camera. So the same procedure like the first time. And once you have it lined up, you give it another press, just like you did for the first one. So I'd recommend this because it protects your lens. Um, if your camera should fall, then the lens would, the lens guard would likely get damaged before the actual lens, uh, which would be more problematic. So uh, you want to make sure though, the microphone holes are exposed so that way they're not covered so you can capture sound freely. Um, what I would recommend after you put it on is to either put the lens cap on um, just to give it a little a better firm press. If you haven't already, please consider liking this video, subscribing to my channel, sharing this video in case someone, you know, uh, could use this information. Um, and this is what it looks like once the lens guard is uh, installed on the camera. So what I think I'm going to do, I'm going to just put it in the pouch just so it could, you know, uh, get pressed down a little bit more and just leave it in there for a while. Just so it could be affixed more firmly. So um, that's the install guys. Um, thank you for watching and again please subscribe, consider liking this video if it's of value to you. 
Um, if there's anyone that you know that might could use this information, please feel free to share with them. Um, and I appreciate you guys. Thank you.